Today's my last day working on this room. As God is my witness, I am getting that room done today. I've already got up and took some allergy medicine. And uh, I'm so sleepy right now. I can't even drive. <laughs> I'm just joking. I can drive. Uh, I am so sleepy right now. I'm going to go get me some coffee. Um, get us some breakfast. Got Maverick squared away. And uh, I'm finishing this room. I really am. Um, oh, yes, I know there's a hill behind me. I'm not going over it. My gas light's on. Gary took my vehicle last night to go spend some pokey stops, and my gas light's on. And they talk about us women. <sighs> <laughs> we built this city on rock and roll. <laughs> Hate pumping gas, Gary Ray. I know this is a typical video for me, um, but for some reason I wanted to share this because that is kind of what I have um, built this social media following empire on was being real and raw that my life has just been going so zoomy about the zoomies for so long with just having a blended family um having a sick dad and <clears throat> trying to divide myself between all the kids and everybody's issues taking care of myself taking care of my husband uh spending ample time you know with friends my mom and you know, it gets overwhelming. It really, it really does. And lately, everything has been coming down on me. The stress of everything. Uh, not being able to go to church like I was going. Uh, money has been tight. Just feeling the sting and the burn of life in general. And you ever just really want to cry, but you can't? And, I mean, you'll even listen to a sad song trying to trigger it. It's just like... It's no different than like trying to drink alcohol to get a buzz or smoking your cigarettes or hitting your vape to get that nicotine buzz. You know, you're like, I've got to trigger a cry somehow because I just need this release. Whatever chemical that releases in your brain when you just have that good scream cry, I need that and I just had that and I feel like a new woman. I'm on my way to my dad's house right now to finish that room. Like I said, I pumped my own gas, but listen, Took me three tries. I had to keep hanging the dang thing up and put my card in there. I, I told my cousin, I said, I'm, I'm sure I've got multiple holds on my card right now from doing it so many times because the pump didn't want to work. But I was listening to some music and was praying, coming over here, and I just had this, I just, this very overwhelming feeling come over me of everything. Like I said, my dad being sick, his appointment yesterday, he got a good report, but the doctor was just dumb as dirt. And I'm sorry, I don't know it, if you know who I am, but I know who you are. And I don't know if you'd ever watch this video, but if you do, you just really didn't do my dad justice at all. And I just don't think you're a very good doctor. And uh, we're going to find him a new doctor. And yeah, I think you probably should stop and ask yourself why you even went to medical school. That's how I feel about you. And sometimes I'm ugly, and that's my ugly face. And it was the Lord's will. I didn't go to that appointment yesterday with my sister because I would have showed my ass. I'm sorry I use Lord and ass in the same sentence, but by God, I am just a normal woman. I am just not perfect whatsoever. I'm not. And I'm normal. I cuss. I love Jesus, but I cuss. And that's just, I'm, I can't live up to the perfect image of, it, you know, I am who I am. I'm almost at my dad's house. i got to get it together. I don't want my dad to think that I'm upset because I'm not. I just needed that good cleansing scream cry that I had. And, uh, and I had it. And, uh, we're, we're getting back. It's okay. This is what crazy looks like. And somebody once said, I wish you wouldn't use the word crazy. People with mental health take it offensive. I need, I'm on two different medications for my mood and depression. Don't talk to me about mental health. I'm raising a severely autistic child. I have a disabled husband that's not physically disabled. Well, he could be physically disabled. He's got a back from crap. He's disabled on his mind because he has 
PTSD so bad, and he's bipolar, and it's a freaking roller coaster being married to him. So do not tell me not to use the word crazy, because you know what? Crazy is what I do. She'll never see this. I blocked her. Love y'all. My dad's went outside to cut grass. Um, he's doing good today. And I really haven't had any music on. Uh, I know, that's not me. I'm trimming. I just find, I don't know, just being still in the quietness. And I've been talking to God a lot this morning. Um, just having a quiet day and I'm enjoying it. And this paint is just, I don't know, it's relaxing. And um, I tried to move the bed and I couldn't by myself. So I've had to whittle my big fat crack between the bed and the wall to paint that back there. And it was not easy. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to finish that. Um, but Gary messaged me a minute ago and his dad's in the hospital now. Um, he's having problems with his heart and he's got a history of AFib. And I guess they're going to have to uh, shock his heart back into rhythm again. And he's going to have to do a three day luxurious stay in the hospital. So Gary's on his way to the hospital to be with his father. So, that's life. You get older and it's time for you to take care of your parents and show up. And it's a little different with us because uh, the other people, my, most people my age are, you know, their kids are grown. They're empty nesters and they have grandbabies. And, but we don't. We still have the little me and Gary had kids late in life. There's nothing wrong with that. So, we got a full plate. So, you know. I don't know why when I started this and started vlogging it and was like, I'm going to get this done in one day. What? What was... There is no amount of crack cocaine that would have got this done in one day. I don't think I took into consideration washing the ceiling, washing the walls, trimming it all, and then having to recode it while painting the walls and painting it all again. Moving the furniture and how many how many days have I been at this, y'all? I think I've made a video every day, but oh my gosh! And I'm I'm determined. I am. I am. <sighs> Don't want this to be inappropriate, but I'm hot now. I ain't about to turn that AC on. But Lordy mercy, I've had to kick on the music now. And today the theme is Jesus. You know, here's the church. Here's the steeple. Here's all God's crazy people. I'm one of God's crazy. People, I know the words to that song. It's one of my favorite. Uh, yeah, but there's been a couple of sad church songs come on there, and I'm like, no, turn that off. We ain't doing that. I missed the whole section of trim back here. I don't know what I was thinking, but uh, getting it on the carpet too. That's okay, cause I think we're gonna jerk this carpet up. Um. So my dad I was allergic to something back here and he said probably an air conditioner if time turn it on he said dust just flies everywhere okay fair enough fair enough i look like a witch <laughs> where's my broom i'll get you my pretty and your little dog too <laughs> i got the room done i did i took some pictures but i'm not ready to do the, my final reveal i know i know don't be mad at me um, I, I thought I took the curtains over there, but I didn't. And I still got to shampoo the carpet. And I need two king-size pillows and a new lampshade. <laughs> so I want to get that done before I, I show you all. But I showed it to my dad, and he said, Boy, one elder, he said, It's too pretty to sleep in. He said, I'd sleep on the floor before I slept in that bed. He said, It looks real. He said, Man, it looks good, don't it? What about that other room? That one you got all that junk piled in. What about it? I said, honey, the sweat ain't even dried on me yet. Uh, I said, it's next on the list. I'm going home, though. I, today, I, I, that, was a, that was a full week's work on that room. I'm taking the weekend off, though. Maverick's daddy's getting him tonight. And, um... Time for mama to go hog wild. In bed early, sleeping in late. Might even soak in the bathtub. I don't know. There's gonna be some crazy stuff go down. That's all I'm saying. 
pretty excited. I think I'm going to go fishing this weekend. I'm taking the weekend off.